Hey guys, Spooks here, and it's been a while, but we are back with some more Dead by Daylight. This time we are doing the Immersed Skull Merchant. This isn't what she typically looks like, but I found a purple and green skin that I thought fit for our channel. So, it has been months since I've played an actual match. I did hop in and play some matches against bots, because they added that as an option to try, so I could try to figure figure her out. Um, it did not help. So she's got these. What is up with your hand? Are y'all seeing that? Like her hands all messed up. Anyways, she's got those little drones that do things. She has a radar. The drones just kind of are surveillance. Anyway, she's, she's very focused on being the best of the best, and she had kind of a weird backstory that was going all over the place with her father being a manga writer or illustrator, and she would, like, flip businesses and gut them, and then she started killing the people that were, like, onto her so that she could fit her, like, father's twisted manga. Anyways, it was kind of weird. I would say probably one of the weaker pack stories, but what are you going to do? So, for her, where she's very analytical and tactical and mechanical, we've got Terminus, simply because it says you are a brilliant technician who prepares for every eventuality, and then Gearhead, I feel like that would work for her and all these gears that she has on her, her blade. I'm sure there's gears in there, right? Do new things still use gears? I'm sure there's gears. Yeah. Anyways, it's even mechanical to me. And then I've got surveillance, because she would stalk her, her prey, her victims. And then I've got thwack, because I thought it was a funny named perk, and the little thing from it is actually from her, her father's dark manga. Manga. I don't, I don't know how to pronounce it. You know what I mean, though. So, after hooking a survivor... The next breakable wall or pallet we break will make servers within 32 meter scream and reveal their aura for four seconds. That seemed like a good thing to have. And then add-ons, we've got supercharged, so increases the battery life of claw traps. So if I can put out these four drones, if a survivor's in the drone's range for a certain amount of time, they'll get a claw trap, and I can pull out a little radar and see them if they have a claw trap, and this this makes the battery life of said claw trap less longer. Anyways, it sounds good in theory. And then low power mode, so increases the duration of drones' active mode. So I, I don't know if it'll actually pick them up if the drones are not active. Because if not, that would, that would kind of suck. I, I couldn't tell. And then I didn't have made an annotated blueprint, because I figured she would have blueprints. Because she's an inventor, and I can't talk. So, without further ado, actually, sorry, if you guys think of a build you think would work better definitely let me know because i think you will know a lot better than i will i've been i have not played this game in a couple months since the night came out so i'm a little rusty a little nervous i don't know if we'll get on our first one probably not we need to get at least three or more kills or if we can get someone if if they have the claw trap on them i think for long enough they become exposed if we can get someone down who has the claw trap on them and they were exposed, we'll count that. Uh, don't think that's going to happen. We'll see. Anyways, without further ado, let's hop on in. Okay, so pretty sure it was a four stack. Uh, that's unfortunate. And I'm essentially the equivalent of a baby killer right now. So that's, that's great. That's okay, though. We got this. We got this. This is fitting. Now I wonder if it will cover both floors. Also, I did learn that they don't... They go out where you first press the left trigger. They don't go and continue with you. Oh, they do go both doors. That is nice. Oh, 
poopy pants. Ah, oh, poopy pants. Let me just crawl over this real slow. Maybe not. Yeah, I know you really, really, really wanted to finish that gen. She didn't. Uh, this is going well thus far. This must have been close for her to risk that. That's not who I wanted to hit. Dang it. I'm trying to figure out the best place to go. her and I don't know where she is. Oh, fetch. Dang it. Mom, baby. She was there. Okay, I'm learning. Wow, they have two left. This is not going great for them.
Gosh dang it. How am I finding you again? I don't want you. She has head on because who doesn't these days? Oh, I hate that perk so much. I have no idea what it is. I only have four hooks. This is going incredibly bad. Keep this going down. I wasn't even going after you. Thanks. I feel like that was kind of wasted there, girlfriend. Oh, I hate this loop. That's fine. This is gone now. Chat pawn. Oh, shoot, that one doesn't have a drone anymore. Oh, yeah, it does. Okay, they're working on a couple different gens at once, and I don't like them very much. I haven't seen you before. They're all getting out of here. Like, that's just how it's going to be. 
That's not at all what I wanted to happen. communicating yeah that's fine you're down there now your buddy's gonna be over here should have done overcharge like I was going to Be a balanced landing. But you don't. Man, it's been so long since I had a hook. I don't think I'm one of those, but maybe. Maybe. Just have them a little stuck here, so. It's you. You're actually not who I wanted to get, but I guess this works. I'm not against it. I even saw it. Ooh, you're still a ghost. That made my knees shake a little bit. I, that was really, I was very anxious with that hit. Hey, there's one. Sorry you kind of got tunneled. That was genuinely not my intention. Someone's over here. Oh no! I actually really don't care. Oh, oh yes. I saw you and I still missed. Oh, these are gone. You already wasted them. I couldn't remember if it was you or the lady that I killed, but it, it, it appears it was you. Someone's up at that generator. Okay, so uh, her ability is actually pretty poppin' if you can get them 3 gen
Also really nice that they can go between floors, and I can just set this right here. No one there. The bird moved. Someone's down there though. Let's set this right here. Right here. Yeah, these drones are pretty nice, especially paired with surveillance. I don't think I'd ever play her without surveillance. That was good. Hmm, still haven't broken that. That's... Well, that's my fault. Come on, buddy. Oh, there's a pallet that way. How do I camp? That fangman was pretty good. Yeah, that fangman only got hooked once. So unfortunate. Sorry, Fang. She may have just been waiting by the doors, though, which would have been the smart thing to do. Oh, I'm sorry. Maybe she has a key, though. She does not. Sorry, girlfriend. I really did not think I was going to find that first. Oh, that was good. I about to just walk right, right into that. There's not a pal here, bud. Sorry. She, she started the dead target. That probably should have given it to her. I'll give you the out. There you go. Now that I kind of, she's she's better to use if you have a couple that are right next to each other, or like a couple gens left. Bye. Feel good about that. Yeah. All right. Also, yeah, she's got the super sassy <laughs> exit walk going on. I don't know why. But, all right, Max the Hunter and Brutality. Interesting, only Devious was that high. That is interesting. Uh, but yeah, that was our immersed um, Skull Merchant build. If you guys liked it, let me know down in the comments below. At first, I didn't have a lot of faith in it, but it started to really work well in the end. So, let me know, and until next time. Stay spooky.
Toodles. <laughs>